Hello, everybody. Welcome to this week's ITL. We're back on the back porch. It's actually a nice, beautiful day today. And yeah, I'm running a little late. That's okay. It's okay. Personally, it doesn't matter. It don't matter. Oh, let's get you out of the sun so you're not reflecting on me. Ah, oh, well, this week's been kind of a kind of a slow week. Not really wanting to do much, a whole lot on this week. Got done what I had to do, but still, it's like, uh, do I really want to do this? Do I want to do that? I actually have Tuesday's video. It's on the camera. I'm working to get it on the on the computer that way I can get it, you know, get do the magic to it and get it up for Tuesday morning. But I got that recorded. Hmm. Yeah, it's like I don't know why this week has just been one of those weeks you just don't feel like doing much. Uh, so it's just one of those weeks. I mean, not a whole lot going on. Not really. Uh, a lot of politic crap going on. But mm, eh, try not to talk about that stuff on YouTube because you know the algorithms don't really like what what, what the right side said. So mm, you know they don't even like. You know, certain terminology, um, which I'll be calling, you know, uh, seeds of love, you know. So, one nice thing about the seeds of love, though, whenever you want to, you know, plant the seeds of love, you need the proper planter. And I believe you should, that really is on an individual basis, will actually fit you, whatever you enjoy, as far as an employment, in a, a seed planter. The seed planter, hmm. They come in many colors, many sizes, many, we'll say seed sizes. So, and it depends on how much, how many seeds you want to really carry and be able to plant. I mean, they have different sizes for that, too. So, just don't forget the seeds of love. Yeah? Don't forget the seeds of love. So, we'll just roll with that for now. <laughs> Ah, oh, this, trying to get around YouTube algorithms, oh my god, I mean, it wasn't proper what I just signed where you can't see, <laughs> oh, I seen that they are coming out, hopefully the vaccine will be out in November, by November, for this, the, the, you know, the, uh, the, 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 we'll call it Chinese pollen. Yeah, the Chinese pollen. Uh, the Chinese pollen vaccine is supposed to be, uh, probably, we're trying to push it out for November, which means they're not really getting through the uh, testing and stuff properly. And, uh, here the government wants to make it mandated. I mean, for, against, whatever, you think, whatever you think about this pollen ordeal um this is in the past things like this being mandated has been fought in courts before and yeah they lost you don't other vaccines you do not have to have your children it's not by law you have to have your children vaccinated you really need them for going into school and stuff supposedly but there's lots of families out there that don't get the children vaccinated. I personally believe that they should be vaccinated, but that, that's still here and there. <laughs> you know? But yeah, I can't see how they can order you to have, put something in your body that you don't want put in. I'm just saying that. Ah, oh, let's go on. Like I said, not a whole lot this week. I am playing ham radio. Uh, for a couple of those of you that actually go into the one hangout, well, we call it a hangout, and it's on Discord, that Dante Fox has on Thursdays. I'll be missing you this week. I have only missed like three years of the hangouts. I do it on purpose for my friend Dante. Yeah, I do enjoy. I enjoy all... all Everybody goes in there, I consider a friend. And, uh, she's like, I, 
I'll be going to a meeting. I guess I'll be jo I'm joining a ham radio club that's not that far away from me in in Ohio. Yeah, because I don't I I prefer the Ohio club over the Hermitage, which is less than three miles away. Because <laughs> they seem to be a little bit snobbish in my eyes. But that's me. That's my opinion. Now I will be going over there on Thursday. And it's about it's the same time timing as the hangout. So yeah, I'll be missing that. And yeah, they will be holding the meeting uh, for uh, basically about QRP. So we'll see what they have to say. We we do social distancing. We got to take our own chairs, have our uh, masks on and stuff, which is going to be difficult. I'll be loosening up mine because I it just it's my breathing problems. Masks and I don't correspond. I just have a little hose. That way, point that way, at least get some air in my myself. But yeah, it, it's a tough one. But we're going to go ahead and do it, and uh, I'm planning on riding the bike, riding the goat over to it. And I'll be coming home in the dark. Yeah, I'll probably have my camera on, recording the video. Hope you have some footage for these guys. Oh. But yeah, currently I am keeping an eyes and ears out for a nice little stubby, even though they're not, they don't really work that well, but a little stubby, uh, 2 meter and 70 centimeter antennas for my magnet antenna for my SUV. The reason it's got to be stubby is because my garage door is really, really low on my SUV. Anything too tall, has a vacant, any height at all, just gets knocked off. And you say, well, I'm just going to put a spring on it. Well, that doesn't help. And I'm going to put the garage door on it and just twists it and just mangles it and it don't work. <sighs> don't ask me how I learned that. But anyway, I do have a little stubby one for my uh, HTs, which works all right. But I want to be able to use my automotive one that I'm currently using as a base for the house. I like to use that in the SUV. That way, it just puts a little bit more power. It is a little bit better than the HTs. But we will see. <sighs> oh, I did try out the uh, APRS with, on Tuesday. I actually got it working. It, it's, I'm just working on how to get it mapped. So I can actually show it. I, I'm working on that. Working on it. Whenever I get it, get it perfected where it's working good, I will go ahead and show it to you on here. That way, if you ever have decide you want to do it, hey, Mike's already did the work. But yeah, well, no more, no sense in jet, keep jabbering and making nonsense up to you guys all this time. This is Muzzle Mike, hoping you all have a great week. Signing out.